What shit like that? She ran crazy with the acid. So I got to help her, but she caused me too. So I backed up off her. How, how old are you, Pops? Me? Yeah. I'm 63. When was you born? East Middle. Middlebrook Hospital, same where you were born at. Okay. East Middle, Middlebrook Hospital, East Middle, Ohio. Right. That's where you were born at. Yeah, definitely. definitely. You said you was there. Yeah, I remember Middle. you told me you named me. I took you there. I took you there. I took you there. I took you there. I named you. Mm-hmm. I named you the giant birth of the day. Right. Took, took me to home. Got to the door. I told I'd be right back. I was in a stolen car. <laughs> right. When I, when I pulled off, yo, let the first step. I, she, where you going? I got to be right back. When I pulled off, I wind up in, at high speed chase, wind up in South Carolina, North Carolina. Mm-hmm. They chased me all the way to Washington, and I, and I lost them. Jumped out of that car, out wide, a tourist, and ducked off and, and went to North Carolina. Now, I, I, I was in North Carolina with my, with my sister, older sister, on Fort Bragg. Right. How were you? Yeah, man, and, um, man, 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 father, my best friend, Rob, my sister had married him. They moved to North Carolina. So I went there and hung there. He lived for a while. He jumped to Miami. How how old were you then? That was in 78. That was in 1978, right? No. Uh, we were born. I was born in 78. Okay. So in about 79. I got that in 80, the Redumpy Riot. And I would have printed from there. How, so how old were you? How old were you back in 78? I don't know, man. I got to calculate that shit. <laughs> uh, my, mind, my mind all fucked up right now. So you was, I'm, what, I'm, what I'm, year you was I'm, born? In 59. Okay, 59. So 60, 78. In 69, I was 10. So you was like 19. 69, I was 20, right? So you was like 19? Why you say that? You said you was born in 59, right? Right. Right, so that's um 19 59, years. That's 19 years right. from 59 to 78. Okay, that's what I was in. Whatever I was, I was young. Right, did you, gra- you graduated from, from high school? So you had did, six trains. You did fifteen years in prison, right? Um, little, yeah, about fifteen. So from that was from night from nineteen eighty to to um, what ninety five? Uh, yeah, I came home. I caught another charge. Came home in two thousand. Right, see, I got an aggravated battery charge. I still had a dude and shit, man, with a, with a pinch on his eye. Right, see, I was so I was born in '78. You went to prison in '80. I went to prison in '94, and you got out of prison. Right. Charge with my brother and Smith the snitched on me. It's in 24 months. I beat that. And I had a new charge just recently in 2015. As I was a bond for. I think I went rock court over 25 years. Mm-hmm. And he dropped that. Valentine's Day, 2022. They dropped it. So I ain't got nothing else on me. I don't have nothing on me no more. Free. But my health, I've been, I've been fucking, I haven't been feeling well. And plus, 
So, so what's what kind of health problems you got? You got, you see, you got high blood pressure and diabetes and shit. I got COPD, emphysema. It took one of my lungs. I lost one of my lungs. Mm -hmm. I don't have no other health problem with that. I got five bullets in me, but they, they, they ain't got to do with them. So, so what about your what about your father? When did he die? Who? Your father. I don't know. What what was his name? Uh, Dennis. Dennis Moore? Yeah. Dennis Junior Moore. Oh, so he was a junior. Yeah. He wasn't a senior. So your great grandfather was Dennis Moore. Yeah. Where they was from? Ellery. Ellery's. South Carolina. South Carolina. Oh, so your family, your father from, no, from South Carolina. All of them came out of Jacksonville. Mississippi? No, Jacksonville, Florida. Okay. My mother, my mother from Ellery, South Carolina. That was your boy. My father from Jacksonville and his whole family, the whole entire Moore clan that I know of. Is in Jacksonville. Right. He migrated with him and four brothers, my mother, and their wives, they came to New York. Right. So did he have any... Shelly, Willa Clay, and him. This three of them. Or two of them did. Willa Clay, all of them lived in New York, too. So Willie Kaymore? Willie Clay Moore, yeah, Dennis Moore, and who what was the other one? Shelly. Shelly Moore. Yeah. All of them live right here on Long Island. Oh, do they? All of Willie Clay, she got three, three Sheila Moore, Deborah Moore, and Lou Willie Moore. He got three kids from his wife Rose. But he got three kids from his girlfriend, Arlene. She's a white girl. Right. Patty, Patty died. Just say Patty died. She was doing armed robbery. She died in prison. His oldest daughter from, from the white girl, Arlene. And um, Laura, Laura's still alive. She still lives in Long Island. Okay. She, she, she was a mother. She was a a boyfriend, she was married, her boyfriend died. She was Lopez. It's on my Facebook page. I got her. And little Willie, he's still hanging with Jesse, but I haven't been in contact with him for a while. Jesse, Jesse has moved to Florida. That's that's your brother, right? Yeah, my oldest brother. That's the one who was, he retired? Yeah, 35 years. Homicide. Ernie, Ernie just left. He was 22 years state trooper in Virginia. That's the, the, he passed. Uh, he passed away. No, Ernie's alive. Okay. They, 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 they fired him. He shot a white boy, and they said the white boy was armed, but the white boy was armed. So he was he was too he was he was he was too much of a cop. They could they had a nickname called Robocop. Right. He was too much of a cop. When he shot that, that white boy, they got rid of him. <laughs> <laughs> right. I told his good boy fuck ass. I told him I told him crack is gonna cost your ass. You you fucking you are against all the black people. You arresting your you you arresting your nephews, Martin and all them, you sweating them so hard they had to leave Virginia. Now his ass wanna to talk to the family. He ain't talked to the family twenty years. He disowned everybody. Now he wanna come back and talk to everybody. I don't fuck with him. I see him. He came down here for the on red um I don't know what the fuck happened. 
it was busy then. All it was busy. My mother's birthday, 4th of July. Hell came down. What you doing? I'm writing down some of this information you're telling me the names of my father, my great grandfather. What I gotta do, what I gotta do is, I gotta, I gotta, we gotta sit down and you gotta, you gotta, you gotta just, what I have to say, I had, I had to research all this myself. Right. I went to Jacksonville. My, my baby aunt, the youngest in the family, still alive when they grow Roberta. Uh-huh. I stayed with her. She got pictures all over the fucking living room wall of everything. And I was so fucking, I was so overwhelmed with all the information she had on the family, right? Right. My grandmother, my great great grandmother, my grandfather, my great grandfather. I mean, she got all the pictures of baby out of all of them. Right. And she never left the house that they were born and raised in. She called, she called me at every two weeks to tell me to come and hang with her. You know? Right. I've been there two times and she don't, she don't want to let me go. You know? And I, and I, and I just leave. And then she be crying and shit. She had a daughter that dropped 18 wheelers back and forth over, over the country. Her son, Ricky, my cousin, somebody ran him over, ran his head over on a motorcycle. So he kind of fucked up because he take care of him. And only two live in that family home. My mother got one, two, three. You got five sisters, right? Uh -huh. Two of them died. One died in Hempstead. And one died at Roosevelt. You got three. basically all my father, all my father's family is dead except Roberta, Helen, Helen Atlanta, Helen Atlanta, and the only three left of the whole eight family. Right. So. Your father is, where's your father buried? Huh? Where's your father buried at? At Greenwood Cemetery, right? If I, in, 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 in Roosevelt? In Roosevelt? Yeah. In Greenwood Cemetery? Yeah, right there. That big ass cemetery in Roosevelt? Right. You always pass all the time? And that's Dennis. Moore. Right. 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 I know exactly where you at. Dennis Moore Jr. Yeah. So he he was born in Jacksonville. Yeah. So his father's buried in Jacksonville. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because he got he got gunned down in Jacksonville. Yeah. So a lot of a lot of the Moors is buried in Jacksonville. Yeah, a whole bunch of them. Well, they probably got a cemetery that they all in there. See, right, right. And see, what we're what we going to do, we want to be able to take that trip with the kids and that thing. This important information that be need to be documented. I would never know none of this stuff if, you know, because sure, I don't know. I had, to, I had to dig it up. But I'm from prison. I'm the one who digs it all up. Right. On my first phone, on my first phone, right, uh -huh. I had everything, all the pictures. I like, 200 pictures and I lost that phone. You got a you got a picture of your father? My father, my grandfather, my great great grandfather, my grandmother, my great great grandmother. You still got any? I'm saying any what pictures do you I got now? The whole family, the whole family having a picnic. They cooking a pig. They kicking a pig and a hog in the ground in Jacksonville. You got it? And all my, I can't, I can't, I lost that phone. So you don't got no pictures no more. No. I gotta go back to Jacksonville and get him off from Roberta. I can call her. She's at a birthday. 
I call it actually seeing some more pictures, right? I have it on. I'll, I'll, Hey, but it's it's like it's like you said, yeah. We need to. That's the type of trip we all need to take. That's a trip. We need to. I hey, need to. I need to I'm go right down there to Jacksonville too. Hey, hey, she called me five times. But I left. You coming back? You coming back? Coming back? Right. And I, I never came back, man. But when I she got caught up in right when she meet me, she gonna be like you came back. Hey, her son Ricky. You know he's kind of. He fucked up. The mother ran his head over. So he like in and out of reality. But he, when I was there, he came about that shit a little bit. That motherfucker cried when I left, man. So what 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 was your father's trade? Um, you can say he it's just he was uh, a farmer. He was a farmer. He operator. We right. We Jacksonville. He was driving tractors. Machine. But when he went to service, he came back out. He was driving crag lines, running loaders. Um, and he could drive any, any machine you can name. Right. That's how I learned how to drive the, um, the front of the loader and the back of mm -hmm. yeah, At Elm Street, he had two dump trucks, two front of the loaders, and a yard. And he owned them. He, yeah, he owned them. He had the yard. He had them in the yard. Right. He had little swimming pools in the ground. So he had his own business then. The man, the man was rich, man. He had a business. He was a business with a, a dude named Frank Frisman, a Jew he grew up with. Right. They started building. They had a business swimming, building swimming pools in the ground. Right. All, all over Long Island. Yeah. Two dump trucks. And he had two. He had a front loader and a back hole. In the yard. What was the name of the company? Huh? What was the name of the company? I don't know. So, so the Moor, trick, the Moors was known in Long Island on business and stuff like that, huh? Right, but we had, we ain't do nothing. We he ain't open no business up. Open no, he ain't started. He stayed in business with Frank. Right, but why you say he ain't open no business up? If he owned the stuff, just because Frank is part of it. I say he owned. I say he owned. I say him and Frank owned a business together. Right. But Frank, Frank was a millionaire. Uh huh. Frank, him up. Frank and Hunter, yeah, they were. They were drinking buddies and everything. Right. Army buddies. Army buddies. <laughs> but I'm saying, why are you saying that he didn't own it? Now explain it to me because you just said he had front end loaders, which was his. Yeah, that was his stuff. No, that was his stuff. But he didn't have no business. We had a business where he actually had a business. Yeah. Right. 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 If he, if he uh if he owned the equipment that's his, he ain't getting, you know, he getting paid to do the job. Yeah, but with Frank. Right. Frank is the person who's getting the Frank like his boss. Frank like his Frank like his boss, man. I guess he wanted Frank to be his boss. Frank was intelligent. He was a Jew. He had the money. Right. He made my father rich. Yeah, that's how it worked. So you would are you dedicated? Yeah. If my father had a business, he didn't tell us about it. But he probably, you know, back then, I'm just saying, you, it's kind of like you said. He wasn't branded, but he owned the trucks and all of that. That's his, you know. He owned that. Yeah, so if that's that's his, that's yours. That You know, that's to be, it's, it's like you said. I get it, but I'm just trying to understand, I, you know, just a lot of things that come from, you know, this family. You know, like you said, that's a business, though. But see, back in the days, they wasn't, it's, it's like you said, it was like a subcontractor. See, a job is when you ride they equipment. You ain't, people around motherfuckers ain't got their own duck trucks and back holes and loaders. Yeah, when you got that type of shit and got a trailer, I'm a subcontractor. That's the type of shit that I'm on, buying the equipment. If we own the equipment, another person can get the contract because they might got the license. They got, you know, they might not want to fuck with me. 
I had to find out, I had to find out for my mom because my father couldn't read and he couldn't write. My mother did all that. Okay. All they know was mathematics. Right. You can look at the ground. You can look at the ground. And give me a ruler. And level. Right. You tell me to walk, walk certain. Walk here, chalk. Walk here, chalk. Walk here, chalk. Walk chalk. Right. Here, my eye did build a twelve to walk with swimming pool. My eye. Right, because he was a moor. In the ground. With, with a bunny and loaded tobacco. That's how I learned how to do it. I, that's how I learned how to use the tobacco and all that. He never taught me. I just watched his ass. Pops, you know, you know what moors are? Yeah, I know. The pro prophet Noble Journey. But these concepts, a lot of these things were taught to kids. You know, like when moors come up, he got a trade. That's that's what you know. That's what masons and all of them. That's why he can work with the Jews and all of these. They they know his. It's already. Who he, he, is. he was Jew. He was Jewish. Right. Dude, no, that's my, my these. Wore, he wore that. Hey, he wore a Jewish hat. He go to all the Jewish churches. He bring all the that 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 stale food on over there. Right. He was an Israelite. I'm saying the, the Israelites the, the is Jews. The Jews is people, melanated people. He a more. He understood who he was. Did so he never, but he never what? He never built with you had to watch everything. He didn't never, like you said. He never forced it on us. He never forced it on us. He never told us what to do. He never said nothing about that shit. Remember he was a Marine. My mother wasn't wearing red hair. But your mother was a Christian. Hey man, he, he only beat me. Nobody else. Right. If you know how to love that, me. I don't know why, but so so did you ever meet his father? Yeah, we should, we should go. We should go. Every summer, we go to Jacksonville. Right. <laughs> Take a trip. We'll be in Cadillac. And we we go to Jacksonville on the station wagon. So, so what was his father like? What did his father do? Um, Pop knew was crazy. She hunted a lot. He hunted a lot. Yeah, he hunted. Yeah. He was get he was selling dairy, bitches, get get sell pig, wild boars. Right. Yeah. It, Trap, trap shit. Right, he a hunter. That's why I learned how to trap shit. Right. But he, he didn't like nobody. He owned he his own land. Huh? He owned his own land down in Jacksonville. Man, the house that he owned, my 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 owner right now that he owned, they owned. Right. Two, 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 two and a half, two and a half acres of land. Right. My father, my my grandfather. Father owned the land. My great, my, my father, 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 that nigga had here all the way down to the to the back in kneecap. What what's his name? Two grand. Two grand. He was a dentist too. <laughs> so it was three dentists, three generations of dentists? Dennis, Dennis Senior, and Dennis Junior. Hmm. And that's crazy. Hey, my mom, what was old And it's crazy because all my, all my sons, all my sons got the same name. Everybody come out of this. Matter of fact, I might next son I'm gonna name him Wilbur. I'm gonna I'm give him. I'm gonna give him the W. I'm gonna give him the W. Well, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. I'm a well, I'm going to do a matter of fact. Kuwait. Kuwait more. You like the Kuwait? I name myself Kuwait. Right. What, what, what do it mean? I just name it because I like that I used to study history. And Kuwait was a country that I just like their I sound. So I, Kuwait likes the country. Right, right, but we're gonna turn it. 
Right. But you know, I'm going to turn that into something definitely prophetic. I like to have a meaning, even if you didn't. No, but on record, I'm sure that, 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 that slave nigga. No. See, as a more, I don't believe in giving away the slave name because it's a system. Like they owed off of this, you know, by me knowing who my people is, everything that you took from us, you know what I'm saying? It's owed through bloodline. This is an ancestry. I go I go back at a lot, a lot, a lot of more more is unique on Facebook. Right. We remember that shit. Right. 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 Yeah, I'm saying if my you grandpa, my, my grandfather had seven brothers, and I don't know none of them. Right. My great grandfather had eight sons, and I don't know none of them. Right. So all those boys we meet on Facebook, we might be related, but we have to attach it. We have to go back. You have to have the blueprint from the beginning for great. I got I got great. I got my father. My father, father, and my father, father, father. Right. I could go, I could go from there. Yeah. No, we you know, here. You just all of them more. My mother is hard to trace. But see, right. But but we right. Because, because she not blood. She not. She not bloodline. But what 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 is what is she from North Carolina? What did she get you? Is she Geechee? Yeah. But she not bloodline. We can't trace her. We can't trace our ancestors to our mothers. You only do it to the father. You don't the blood. But you can though, cause see, your mother's your mother bloodline is relevant too because of your your father. I know it's relevant. I know it's relevant. But if, if it don't go back to the great if you don't know my great grandfather and my great great grandmother, she ain't relevant no more. Yeah, but what you what you mix with is what you create. So it's like you said, it still go to the man because, like, say my mother, right? Her, her my mother father is relevant to my bloodline because that's that's the trail that it's coming from. Not my mother, but my mother's father. You know, that's what you mixed into, but he created. Cause that's his, and then it traced from there to every man this that came from his bloodline. Right. And you're the same way. Right. You can trace back to every man that came out of your blood, but you can't. You can't trace every woman on your mother's side. Well, it's probably easier to go like because I have never heard you telling me so you feel me so now that i know you know all i knew is your name so to even know my great my aunt, when great I, when I was trying to do him when i was trying to get information from my aunt she told me ask my mother she know my mother know more than she do than my mother was there before she was born <laughs> but right but see like my, my mother, mother she don't want to talk Oh, my she mother knew. She you, knew. Man. She knew who your name was. She knew your mama, your sisters. So she told, but she didn't know who your father's name was. You know what I'm saying? I know who father name was that Dennis Moore. That's a that's an important bloodline. And then three generations of it. You know what I'm saying? But I'm saying she never told me his name. You know, if I ask her, you know, what's Pop's no, father's name? She, 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 she didn't know him. She didn't know him. By him kicking my ass when he sees my ass. <laughs> <coughs> when, I, no. when, I moved, when I moved to my sister's house in Roosevelt, Bridget knew my sister, Risa. Right. So how? So you you what? what? Yeah, I, I, I moved in with Risa, and that's how me and Bridget got tight. That's how me and her became like associated with each other. So is you the youngest? She comes to school. She always. If she walked by the house, she walked by the house. When she come from school. 
Right. I'm saying you the youngest child of your mother. No. Of the boys. No. So I'm saying, but by the time you was I'm born, you had grown. I'm the second oldest boy. Okay. Are you the second oldest boy? Who? So so who right, older than you? Okay, so the four people older than you, how how much, how far are they apart? Like they was grown when you was little. Larita, girl, the girls, Larita, Steen, Jeanette, and Jennifer. Okay. Those are the four oldest that I can remember. Right. So I'm saying they was grown when you was a kid. I, mean, I, I, I was fifth, and then we were twin. We were fifth, and it said. Oh, so you had a twin. Who? Shirley is my twin. That's your twin brother? My twin sister. She my sister. Shirley is my sister, man. Oh, Shirley. I thought you said Troy. I thought you said Troy. Okay, you said Shirley. Shirley, Shirley, Shirley is my twin. Identical, but I was born first. She is my twin. Wow, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I never heard that before, Pop. So we got twins. I, I make. I can make twins. I got some twins in my shit. My father, yeah, a twin. Yeah. I ain't know that. Yeah. Surely is my twin. That's what I told you. My twin would tell me she would charge me five hundred dollars to sleep in the other room. No, nah, listen, like Pops. I swear. Listen to what I'm telling you. Even when you said that, I thought you was just using slang. I never. You know, I hear you. you know what I'm saying. I never knew that. Uh, Shirley is your twin sister. Hey, Bridget, no. Bridget, no, Shirley. I, but she know a bitch. I never heard that she was your twin. But she, 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 she wasn't paying no attention to her. Shirley was a tomboy. Shirley would fight, be fighting every goddamn body. Wow. Man. She was running with a gang, running with a gang of females out of the neighborhood, calling herself the, 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 the baby spades. And they were fighting every goddamn body that came in that neighborhood and fucked with a nigga over there. They ain't had nobody fuck the boy. They, and they thought all the boys belonged to them. So, like so, people. so, so who is Shirley Kids? Andre, Keisha, and Shonda. You know Shonda. She be talking to you all the time. That sugar. Yeah. You know what, see? Now that I, that's what I'm saying. I knew you was finna say sugar. Because see, yeah. that's being that that's your twin, you know, yeah. like I, you know, we we mess with each other like that. I, I mess I with, them. but I yeah, know. that's that's because that's a twin. I ain't know that was your twin sister, pops, for real, yeah. right? Because I, I was wondering, my mama said that she had stayed with Shirley before. Yeah, she probably did. But she never told me that I was her to your twin sister. I'm gonna ask her too. Know. I'm like, pops. I'm like, did you know Pops was a, had got a twin? She probably didn't know. Right. Bridget yeah. and Ingrid and Shirley were pretty cool. And, and Bridget and Ingrid used to hang out together. Right. I live with Ingrid and I live with I live with Bridget. You know? When my family left Miami, my mom took all of them except me. I was locked up when she left. Wait, when did so she, she leave? Out. That was uh, like 80 what? About 77, 78, something like that. But I was born in 78. They was gone. Oh, they was gone before I was born? Yeah, about 76, 75, something like that. Oh, okay. So they was. They were gone. Oh, okay. Gone. Yeah. When I got out of uh, Juvenile Detention Center, I, I, me and my other one, my brother was on Elm Street. Me and Jesse lived with my father. Well, I didn't live with my father. I had to sneak in out the house, but he ain't wasn't there. He didn't like me. I had jumped over a couple times. Dennis Jones, more. Yeah, 
knows his wife before he that's with the white girl. But those are his three kids that be over there with Jesse. You right. probably seen him or met him, but didn't realize who they were. Right. Jesse always has a little, always this dudes always hang around Jesse for, for a long time. When he killed my uncle, he stayed with Jesse for a while. <laughs> Deborah and Sheila, you if you look at them, I both them got my uncle eyes, light brown eyes, but they got all got the same facial features. Oh no, I can and tell them more. Yeah, it's like you said. Yeah, the cheekbones we... and that line that comes down from your face, from your nose. See, when we be on Facebook, they got a whole, like you said, we don't even be knowing how we related. We can see and know we, you know what I'm saying? Because I ain't like seeing it, like, because when, you know, a lot of people be asking me. Now I know, like, a lot of people be asking me. I be knowing who my father's name is, but, you know, it's like level. So, you know, I know from, um, now I know more than New York. I know from um, Jacksonville, Florida, and Dennis Moore. There's a whole chain of them two down there. So, you know. That's that's somebody uncle. That's somebody like you said. That's somebody uncle. They granddaddy is my granddaddy brother type of shit. And they know it. Yeah. Yeah. The other thing is, there's so many, there's so many. A great grandfather has so many kids, and you gotta be careful. <coughs> One more you mess with. Like that's why I'm glad Facebook. Right. If I really want it, I get every more on Facebook. And I dissect them if I wanted to to find out how far they go back. But I had to go back first to find out because I got that. I got that great, great, great. You know? Right. I, I met these people. I lived with them. I hung around them. You know? My grandmother, my, my father, mother, her hair was so long, she was a real Indian. We just tie our fucking hair, but she should sleep. We would tie her hair at the bottom of the chair, but she can't move. So, so was Dennis was Dennis married? Okay, which which Dennis um the, for the the I'm Dennis? Only married to my mother. No, not your not your father, your grandfather. He was married to your. Only to my mother. What was? Only to my grandmother. What was her name? Ellery Moore? No, she was uh, Pickens. Pickens? She became a Moore when they married. Okay, oh, so you know, you know the maiden name too, huh? I know my mother's maiden name. I know my grandmother's maiden name. I know my great great grandmother's name. I know all of them. I told you, I, I, was, I went, we used to go to Jacksonville like every summer. I was, I was, me and my sisters are going to Miami and visit my mother's side of the family. She had a lot of people down here in Miami. But my father and shit, he's take us, me and Jesse, he's always take us to Jacksonville him when he was going to visit his father. He, he wanted us to know his father. Right. So he used to take us all the time. Okay, Pop. Yeah. Yep. How let me later. Down the street. But I'll call you back. Uh, I love you too, bro.